Moving over to cricket, where the 15th edition of the Indian Premier League is still some time away, but 590 players are set to go on auction this weekend. Among the 220 overseas players from 40 nations is South Africa's sensational batting youngster, Diervald Brevis. The 18-year-old Brevis, who is nicknamed Baby AB after AB de Villiers, was prolific in the recently concluded Junior World Cup in the West Indies. He was named player player of the tournament after smashing a record 506 runs at an average of 84.33. The record run haul saw him eclipse the previous 18-year-old record of 505 runs held by Indian skipper Shikhar Dawan. Deval joins us now via Zoom for a bit of a chat. Deval, good morning to you. Thank you so much for your time. The other day I was chatting to um, Titan CEO Jacques and he had said to me, you know, Deval used to sit on the embankments, um, on the grassy embankments, watching all of these matches. And of course, there are a lot of kids who enjoy watching cricket, but at what point did you decide that you actually want to make this professional? No, firstly, yeah, thank you very you much for having me. Okay. It's, I'm very grateful. Thank you idea, first right? for having me. I'm very grateful for this. Um, yeah, so firstly, it all started from a very young age. I had a love and passion for the game. And that's where everything started. Um, cricket is my passion. And from a very young age, I was born with a ball in my hand. That's what my mother said. So, yeah, as you can think, all ball sports I played. But cricket was always the sport that stood out for me. And then later on, I just kept on working on my cricket and also played other sports. But cricket was my only passion and I just went fully for it. And yeah, my whole life, um, we live quite close to Supersport Park with the Titans home ground. And yeah, I, I always remember the days where I sat on the big grass embankments and in the stadium asking for autographs and watching the games. And now it's so it's such a big privilege to be able to play on that field and to practice on that field and to be part of the Titans team. Now, Diva, congratulations to you on uh, being uh, named player of the tournament at the Under-19 uh, World Cup. I must say, the record that you broke there is an 18-year-old record, and you are just 18 years yourself. So that is exceptionally well. What was the, that experience for you, um, being, a, be, uh, being a part of the, uh, the tournament? No, yo, it was a wonderful um, experience. Um, so excited and there was a lot of learnings and a lot of um, quick learnings you had to adapt to in that conditions and everything but to just be able to break a record like that um, playing aside big names and breaking a record of one of the biggest cricketers in the world it's it's a big honor and i'm very grateful for that Talking about the big names, of course, I did mention the IPL, where players are going on auction this weekend, and you are one of the lucky stars um, that are part of the group of players there. How do you feel about that? Um, what are your prospects, though, when it comes to um, the IPL? I'm certain you probably do have some, some ambitions to be uh, part of that setup. How are you feeling ahead of the auction? No, I'm feeling very excited, but still I'm trying to, one of the things that I've worked on and always trying to do in my cricket is to stay in the moment and not to think too far in the future so i'm still playing a game today and i'm at the titan so to be honest i'm just thinking of the now and i'm putting the ipl just a bit aside and focusing on the cricket that i'm playing now but i'm so excited to be part of the ipl it's a big dream of me um, from a very young age I grew up watching the IPL, the whole family, everyone has a different team in our family. So it's a very big thing and it's a big honor to be included in the auction. It's good to hear that you are focusing on the now, dear Vault, because the one thing I'm quite interested to know is how you're coping with all of this pressure. I mean, you know, I mentioned earlier, you're already being termed baby AB and you are just 18 years old and you have the privilege of playing with all of these people that you do idolize, that you sat watching. So when it comes to the pressure that is mounted on, you know, an 18 year old's shoulders and the psychological impact of being on a world stage, um, how, do you, how do you deal with those things? 
I think, as I said previously, it's very important to stay in the moment. Um, it's a big honor, like A.B. De Villiers is my role model from a very young age. So being compared with him, um, I can't tell the emotions and the excitement. It's such a big thing for me because um, when you grow up watching someone and wanting to be like him because you're a youngster and now you are called baby A.B., it's a big honor. But as I said previously also in some of the questions people ask me, um, it's important for me that people also like get to know me as the adult DB um, to like have my own identity. But being compared with IB, um, I would never want anything else. He's a hero, he's a living legend. But yeah, it's it's wonderful. Um, been working very hard, but it's important to if there's pressure and a lot of things to just stay in the moment because. If you're in the moment, then you like just forget about all of those things, and then you focus on the things that's happening right now. So that helped me through the World Cup, and it's still helping me, and I'm trying to focus on that. So, DB, very quickly before we go, just uh, talking about the Titans uh, setup that you are also part of now. There are some great players there, you know, Quinton de Kock, Heinrich Klaassen, Lungin Gidi, Tabrez Shamsi. These are exceptional players who have also been part of the Proteus setup. So, in terms of your development, um, have they given you any tips? I'm sure uh, the older guys have, have uh, you know, already started assisting you um, with your career, you know, and, and what to do along the way. No, it's, it's been great. Um, I haven't really been a, a lot part of the group because I was still last year in school and I had to write the exams and everything. So I missed out on a lot of practices and everything. But the time I had now with the senior players like, like Quinton and Heinrich Klaas and then Dennis De Bruyne and all these guys like Shamsi, it's, it's really a big honor. And they are such wonderful people like for me as a youngster to they just pulled me in and made me feel comfortable because obviously it was nervous for me at first to join the team and they were so nice to just be opened up to me and pulled me into the group so i'm very grateful for that and your yeah, learnings like always in the nets um there's small things to say it's not always a big thing but it's the small things that help you a lot. Um, they don't try to give you too much information sometimes. Just, as I said, something small that helps a lot. Well, DB, we're going to have to leave it there for now. But thank you so much for your time. Once again, a big congratulations on the achievement that you had at the Under-19 World Cup. And we wish you all the best with this booming career of yours that you have. That was Diervald Brevis joining us to talk about cricket and his recent uptick in form. We'll have more